Yeah, yeah, big storm coming, black rain coming First in the world, tell me who won it Winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep Big storm coming, black rain coming First in the world, tell me who won it Winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep I see what he's doing. I see what he's doing. I see what he's doing. Okay. Come, nah, hey, you fool me once, you cannot fool me twice. And that was fourth and seventeen. Who who do you know? Who do you know goes fourth on fourth and seventeen? Uh What's up everybody, this is your boy Black Rain 4 and today before we start the video, I just have a few things I would like to discuss. Number one, the content that you guys are seeing is pre-recorded content. So there's been days where I've grinded three and four videos, you know, but I can only post one. And the next day I grind three, four videos, I can only post one that day. So I have content that have built up over time, but it's good content so I cannot throw it away. So. The things, you, the things you guys are asking for, like the stick work video, um, me playing with different teams, I have those coming. I do have a stick work video for the guys that keep asking in the comments, I'm asking for a stick work tutorial, where is it at? It's coming. It's not a tutorial, but it is a stick work video where I am doing it in game and I'm explaining how to do it. I am setting it up in game. You, there's no way for me to do a tutorial on it. In practice because I have to do it versus a live user so I do it in game cool we got that squared away we have a stick work tutorial game film coming cool you guys want to see me play with other teams it's just the Chiefs he can play with you know it's just the Chief you know he can only do the stick with McCoy and he can only run deep with Tyreek Hill and he can only throw in the run with Patrick Mahomes and no I have videos coming where I'm playing with other teams. I'm not saying I'm playing with the Dolphins or, you know, things like that, because I'm still playing the top guys in the world. You know, I'm not playing one of the top guys with the Dolphins. I'm not running into one of these guys with the Dolphins. But I am playing with, you know, decent teams, good teams, and I am making my scheme work. I am proving that it is the scheme, not the team. Scheme over team, but the team will definitely make the scheme better. Okay. Number three, that's six. Number three, the most commonly quest, the most common question that I am getting asked: Why do you not play mud? Okay, quick story. I had a best friend. Well, he's still my best friend. Um, so he was like, you know what? I'm gonna grind mud. I'm gonna beat those top guys. I'm gonna be a pro, and I'm just gonna take those guys out. I was like, bro, you don't even have to do that. All you have to do is just grind reds, you know, stream a little bit, get your name known. And now you're out there. He was like, nah, I'm, a, I'm doing mud and I'm going to beat the top guys and I'm going to get my name known that way. I was like, cool. So he's doing pretty good right now. I'm not going to say what it is, but he's doing pretty good right now. So I started playing rigs and I was like, you know what? I'm actually pretty good at this. I looked at my record and I had a pretty good record. You know, as you can see, well, you can't see right now. My record is pretty good. So I'm grinding rigs. I get like... 100 in the world. I'm like, man, I am like top 100 in the whole world on Xbox. So I get to like number 40. I start streaming on Twitch. I built up me a fan base. Now I'm doing great. Before you know it, I go on a 73 game win streak. I am number 8 in the world on a 73 game win streak. I end up losing. I'm like, man, I don't know if this is for me. But I still keep playing. I go on another 48 game win streak. Now I am number 1 in the world. I'm battling with Timmy Tutor. You know, Ted at 49er, I'm battling with these guys for the top spot. We're interchanging one, two, three, one, two, and three. I finally get to number one, and that's when I take off. And now I am number one. I've been number one for a long time. You know, I don't really battle with anybody now for the number one spot. And I feel like I've got it hard for that. Now, what sense would it make for me now to go and switch to mud? It makes no sense. I just grinded all this time. As a Rex player, I'm comfortable with, as a Rex player, I'm comfortable playing with the Chiefs. It makes no sense for me now to go and spend real money to build up a month team that guys have already built up and then try to compete with those guys. 
It would be pointless for me to do that. That's like asking the mutt guys now to come to regs, get your regs team, start from zero and zero record, and now try to come and catch my record and be number one now. They, th those guys would not do that. It, it's, it would be pointless for them to do that. So, I am going to stay in the regs community. You know, I am going to make it cool for guys to play regs again. Just get on, you know, play a regular match, you know, without having to build up a team and do this and that and trade him and put this much cap on him and get take his ability from him and give it to him. And No. I'm going to make it cool now to just get on with your team that you're good with, play another guy with a team he's good with. You beat him, cool, you know. So that's what I am here to do. I built up my fan base in the Rex community. I want to continue to build up my fan base. And that is that. Why I do not play much is simply because I am a Rex player. I have grinded Rex. I'm going to stay in the Rex community. And that's that. So, I hope I cleared up a few questions. Once again, the content that you guys are seeing is old content. I do have a stick work video coming. I do have me playing with other teams. And now, on to the video. Whichever way it's going to slide. That way, that way. On to hold the on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. One more thing. People ask why I do not post my losses. Okay, I do not turn my camera on for every single game. Okay, so if it's an opponent that I've already recorded before, you know, and I play him a lot, I will not record the game simply because I don't want you guys seeing the same gameplay, basically. So, I was winning the game that J-Rock beat me on my 53 game win streak, if that's the game you guys are referring to. I was winning that game. You know, I didn't really think much of it to record it. And then he came back and beat me. You know, that's that's my fault. I don't record it simply because I play eight to nine games a day. You know, I don't want to record eight to nine games and then, hmm, let me go through and see which game would be best for me to post. And, you know, so I don't do it like that. I see an opponent that I, that I know is in the top 100 or something that I have not played before or something like that. And then I record it. So to clear things up. If I am recording and I happen to lose, I would post it, you know, but if I'm not recording and I lose, there's nothing I can do about it. Like I can't go and like recapture that and then put the commentary on it because the commentary I do is live, you know, it is, it is live. I don't record gameplay and then put the commentary on it. So it's basically live. Cool. And if you do see my record go down and I have not explained that I lost. It's because I got a DC loss. And what a DC loss is, it's a disconnection loss where um, you lag out of the game. It'll say like your connection's bad, which your connection really isn't bad at all. But it's something wrong with Madden servers and it'll disconnect and it'll give one of you guys the loss randomly. You know, so it might I might be up 21 to 0 and I might get the DC loss. Or he might be up and he might get the DC loss. It's just random. So if I do not explain a loss, then it's most likely a DC loss. Because I am not afraid to say that I've lost. It just sucks that I have not posted any losses on here because, one, the only loss that I've lost to was, um, at this point, J-Rock. And I did not have my camera on for that. Other than that, I might have had a DC loss here and there, and there's nothing to record for that. So, all right, now we can... What's up, everybody? What I'm doing right now is I am looking through the Seahawks roster because there's rumors that I can only play with the Chiefs. You know, rumor has it I only play I can only play with the Chiefs. So I'm gonna find a team with a similar play style, you know, because I like the Chiefs play style. I don't just have to use the Chiefs. So I am looking at the Seahawks roster. Um, I have never used them. So I don't really know who they have. I mean, I watch NFL so I know like I know who's on the Seahawks team, but I've never used them before and I never really so what I'm doing right now, I'm going through their roster, I'm seeing what they got for me. Because I am going to use the Seahawks. So, I'm like, okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take KJ right out. Simply because I like the speed of King Griffin. And in the middle, oh, I can put, okay, I have Bobby Wagner and KJ right in the middle. Kendricks, Griffin, 
Wow. Okay. Six three corner. Okay. Who are my safeties? I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter what my safeties are, you know. Kick return, lock it. Let's see. Power back, third down back. Nothing changes. Okay, cool. So it looks like I am gonna use the Seahawks. Seahawks it is. And I use the Seahawks playbook already, so this is a plus. And my defense is multiple D, but I have a custom. The only reason it's a custom is because I have my audibles already set. You know, I couldn't do that with the multiple D, so I just made the multiple D, made my audibles, and changed it. And changed the name of it. So Let's see what we got. Seahawks. Let's go. Eight minutes and I am still searching for a game. Eight minutes. I have sat here right in front of the screen for eight minutes waiting on an opponent. This is one of the big reasons I don't stream on Twitch anymore. I was big on streaming on Twitch. You know, it was taking three to four minutes. Here we go. Eight minutes and 30 seconds I found a game. It was taking three or four minutes to find a game. So, you know, that was cool, you know. But sometimes it literally takes 10 to 12 to 15 minutes to find a game, you know. I go out in the living room and I watch TV and I eat. And I do all kinds of things while I wait on the game to start. But when I'm streaming on Twitch, it's hard for me to do that, you know. I have to entertain people and sometimes, you know, they don't want to sit here and wait 15 minutes for me to find a game, you know. They want to see they want to see gameplay, you know. And that's, and that's why I kind of switched to YouTube because it's straight gameplay. So, oh, we got J. Rob. Wow. Okay. Um. Man, this is. An, I don't think this was a good time for me to be trying a team, but here we are trying a team. You know, we're trying the Seahawks versus J. Rob. Um, he's currently on a 20-game win streak. He's hot right now. So, this is this is actually the guy who ended my. Um, he ended my 53-game win streak. This guy right here, J. Rob. So. Here we go. Okay, nice little run. Nice little run. Put a half back screen in here. So I can catch him slipping. Wow. Okay, that was not good, you know. Wow. Okay. Okay, I don't know how the the blitz radar works for for um I have no clue how the blitz uh, radar works for Russell Wilson. I've never played with him, so wow. Okay. Are we serious? He's so he's only gonna run three plays the whole game. He's gonna be stretch, inside run. Yeah, just stretch and inside run basically. And what comes with the stretch is there's an RPO uh, slant backside. So Seahawks are way better at stopping the run. I see that already. People are getting off blocks and Yeah. So, I see what's going on here. I see what's going on here. Take his field goal. Cool. I am trying the Seahawks. People said I cannot play without the Chiefs, so you know this is not a good opponent to be trying a team on. But you know, this is a good test for me. This is a great test for me. Stick. The stick is still there. 
the stick is still there. Now it's not just the Sean McCoy and no, the stick is there. The stick is there, as you can see, the stick is still there. So that cleared up a few. You know, I've gotten a few comments, people asking, people ask, could I still be sticky without the Sean McCoy? You know, and <laughs> you see it, there's proof right there. There is your proof. But I guess I do have blitz radar, so I can tell when. So everybody's blitzing right now, I guess. Wow, this is this is something new, man. This is something new. This is weird. Wow. So everybody's blitzing. Man, everybody is blitzing. Maybe I can get a running back out in the flat, you know? Wow. Wow, that's <laughs> that is amazing. On third and fourth down, I can see everybody who's blitzing. You know what I would do? You know what I might do? Run the ball on first and second down. And just on third and fourth down, I can tell, you know, basically what you're doing, you know, so. That might be what I do. Just run the ball on first, second down, third down. I can see what you're doing on defense and I can, cool, you know. How great is that? How great is that? Let's go, man. My, it's not about the team. It is about the scheme. It is about the scheme. It is not about the team. It is about the scheme. Because with your scheme, you have to make reads, you know. R regardless of the team, you got to make reads. Great defense, you know. So, wow, that's my fault. Oh, we got a fumble. Pass play. Here's the pass play. Yep, there's the pass play. Okay, cool. There we go. Come on. What we got? Here we go. Here we go. What we got? Here we go. What we got? Let's go, man. Let's go. And I feel a bit disrespected because, oh, stick. I feel a bit disrespected because I am part of his 20 game win streak. So I guess he's not blitzing right here. This is crazy. Like he's literally not blitzing. Now he's blitzing. Now he's blitzing, wow. Wow, that, that's crazy. That thing is <laughs> that thing is crazy. I'm gonna take my uh, field goal because he gets the ball at uh, halftime. So you know I wanna I wanna at least go into the half. You know at least up seven points. You know so he's gonna throw the slant. He's not gonna throw the slant. Look at it, like look at that. Like he already has his arm out. Like as he's running, he could like be turning the corner up the sideline, but instead he's Ready to armbar my guy. The armbar gives him a boost of speed as he does it. And he's just ready to just fly past my guys. That's... I don't know, man. I guess that's a... I mean, he's won 20 games straight doing that. So, hey. If it works, it works. Okay, 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 okay. Three yards, okay. Oh my god, he threw it. No, he, I know he did not turn back and pick my guy up. No, that, that is literally no way, man. Literally no way. Oh my God, man, like, 
I need a score right here for a fact. I need a score right here. And then I'm gonna need a stop. Definitely gonna need a stop. Oh my god, that is my fault. That is my fault. Why did I not stay outside? He's not blitzing, apparently. Still no blitz. Okay, we should be good. And that's a dot. And that is a dot, you know? That is a dot. Like it looks like I have a lot of room outside. I do. And that's thick. I do, and that's thick. So I am milking the clock, I am in field goal range. I'm gonna go ahead and score, you know. I'm gonna go ahead and score. I'm gonna say that I got defense. I got defense. I can get a stop. That's what I'm saying. I can get a stop. Especially a touchdown. I can hold him from getting a touchdown. Not just a field goal, but a touchdown, you know? So, we're good. This should be perfect. Because I got it. Let's go. I'm sitting back myself for that slant. I want that slant. Why do my guys backpedal? Like, why couldn't they do that like the last down? Why couldn't they just do that? Like, what? What was different? Oh, yeah, that's me. That's me. Pass rush. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Last minute adjustment. Thank you. Come on, man. Let's go. They said I can't play without the Chiefs. Look at me now. Look at me doing it. Come on, man. Come on, man. And this is the same guy that broke my 53 game win streak. I did not get to record the game he beat me. My house was loud and I just, the audio was terrible and I just, you know. And I know people want to see my losses, but that was literally my only loss. And it upsets me that I did not get to record it. That, this guy's the only person who beat me. He broke my 53 game win streak. Is this guy gonna run my offense now? He got <laughs> What in the world? Like what? I don't understand people like Now you go to my place Oh, you just gonna try it one time? Thank you Th Come on man, don't, if you gonna cheat me Jesus I figured out how to stop it. Wow. Wow, I just fit. Wow. Now I just now figured out how to stop it. Wow. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Those are user skills. I know my singing. I know my singing is good, so don't tell me it's not, because I know it's good. But those are user skills. You know, I got him out of his comfort zone. You know, I'm playing with a different team. He caught me with a different team. Wow. Look at that. Outside is open. And 84. What, like, what are you doing? That's good. What a dub. 
What a dub. Let's go, man. First time ever really playing like an online game without the without the Chiefs. And look what happened, you know. I can play with wow. 760 wins, 75 losses. Um that just added my to my streak. I'm giving up less than 11 points a game. That guy was was on a 20 game win streak. He is currently ranked 34, I think. Cause I, I literally just looked before I played. 33. Okay, cool. Yeah, minus one. He was on a 20 game win streak. So yeah, GG's to J Rog. GG's to J Rog, man. What a game. It was really my first time without playing with the Chiefs, and it worked out great, you know. Um, so I can play with any team, you know. It's not really to me, it's not really the team, it is the scheme. You know, you can have a great team and have a terrible scheme and you can lose. You know, that's like that's like when somebody get that's like people selling ebooks. You know, you can buy somebody's ebook, but at the same time, if it's really not your scheme, when it gets down to the crunch mode, you won't be comfortable with it because you don't really know the ins and outs of it. All you know is what plays work, you know. So um, ebooks are effective, but Personally, what I think you should do, create your own scheme, you know, find plays you're comfortable running. Once you find those plays you're comfortable running, stick to them, figure out what works against all defenses, you know, the cover two, the cover three, the cover fours, the man to man. Just find out and just perfect your scheme, you know. Ebooks are helpful, you know, you can grab a little bit from each ebook, but if it's not your scheme, I feel like it doesn't work, you know, so. Yep, thank you guys. I'm glad you guys got to witness that. You know, I'm glad I got that on film because, you know, I've been hearing rumors that I can't play if I don't have the Chiefs and, you know, which which isn't true because I have a great scheme, you know. So, glad you guys got to, got to witness that. So.